Welcome to San Francisco, California. For over 200 years, the technology behind these cable cars has transited passengers throughout San Francisco. In nearby Mountain View, Google is working on Google Cloud Platform. Let's head over to Google Cloud Next and check it out. 25,000 developers have joined with 3,000 Googlers to discuss Google Cloud Platform and the future it contains. Coming up, an exciting new three-way partnership with Intel, SAP, and Google, updates from executives in the driver's seat of the Intel-Google partnership, and we'll take an exciting spin in a fun AI demo. From the Moscone Center in San Francisco, California, I'm Brian Westbrook. This is Shift, presented by Intel and GeekWire. I want to get right into some exciting news Google Cloud presented Intel with its Partner Award for Innovative Solutions Infrastructure. It's a really big deal. To be honest, I think it's the thing I would hope for most with any of our partners. It means that as they build out the infrastructure, which is core to everything they do at Google, whether it's search, to their Google Cloud, and to all the platforms and enabling that they do, it means we were a partner that helped them do that the best. We're just delighted that Intel, one of our key technology partners, won an award in innovation at our next conference this year. We've been working together with Google for over 15 years on our cloud, joint cloud infrastructure, and it's in recognition of that partnership and the work that we've done. We customize, we optimize, we tailor, we can build things absolutely 100% unique for Google. We can help them make something better and bring those technologies to market faster. How does Intel and Google Cloud bring price performance leadership, cutting edge technology, and innovation to modernize enterprise IT? Regine Skillern with Intel tells us more. So we're at the beginning, as I say, even though I've been doing public cloud, I've been doing it for 10 years, I still feel we're at the beginning of an incredible innovation. And this innovation creates nearly unquenchable demand for better and more efficient technologies and solutions in the data center. You had a keynote session today, a spotlight talk. Tell us about that and, and what were some of the key takeaways? We got to spend 45 minutes, uh, myself, with a distinguished engineer, Partha, from Google and with another partner talking about the results of that alliance and partnership. And then we also announced our partnership with SAP, Intel, and Google to bring our revolutionary memory technology, the Intel Optane Data Center Persistent Memory Technology, available uh, soon from Intel to transform the way you do large memory instances and services for SAP HANA and SAP HANA users on GCP. Right now, it can take you four you know, minutes to reboot your SAP HANA instance. But with uh, the Optane uh, memory, that could be down to seconds because the data will stay in memory during your, your reboot. And SAP has been working in collaboration with Intel and us to actually optimize that for that work case. This is really changing the way the applications look at memory in that storage and memory hierarchy and working with customers like Google and ISV partners like SAP and bringing together really strong technology-based companies to fix and figure out and solve all these problems for our customers. A lot of the newest technologies are showing up first in the cloud. You take the um, Google Cloud, first to deploy Intel Skylake uh, version of the scalable Xeon processors. We had 3,000 customers using Skylake before it was available anywhere else. And bringing new technology like that together uh, is something that we and Intel have been doing a great deal. And we see the developments this year is just adding to that legacy. The challenge, drive my Sphero through an obstacle course before being derailed by sharks powered by artificial intelligence. The red AI sharks are an example of reinforcement learning by TensorFlow optimized on Intel Xeon scalable processors. As the game continues, the AI sharks get smarter. Lots of competition to win a spot on the Intel leaderboard and I've got some work to do. One of the things that Intel works with Google on, Google Cloud specifically, is the partnership around IoT. Tell us about that partnership. The IoT partnership really brings together Intel-powered uh, edge computing devices uh, connected to the Google Cloud. Really what the Extreme Cloud Center of Excellence and Echo is all about is helping business people with big ideas deliver those big ideas by removing the friction, dealing with the objections, and actually proving that their idea is possible. 
cloud is a way to make compute and technology easier for people to consume, easier to use, cheaper to use, right, and more pervasively used, that accelerates the market. So every company that can go from brick and mortar to the old way of doing things to be a digitally transformed company, they're going to have better services, more services, more customers, more customer value. That accelerates the market for all of us. So in particular, we're really excited about the partnership with Google Cloud, and we're hoping in the coming years to build a multi-billion dollar business together. Thanks for watching Shift, presented by Intel and GeekWire. I'm Brian Westbrook from Google Cloud Next in San Francisco. We'll see you next time. In the meantime, check out geekwire.com slash shift for all of our videos. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Be sure to comment and share. We want to hear from you. Until next time.